tally and accounts and uh, something with, yeah there will be um, a training on uh, accounts and uh, may request everyone else to be on mute okay so kindly mute everyone yeah fine actually it muted me also anyways i have unmuted okay <laughs> So uh, there are a lot of things which will be there on the way. Okay, there's nothing we are promising like jobs or other stuff, but it all depends upon your efforts. So please, uh, first of all, be dedicated. Dedicated in sense, uh, be available on time, and whatever the assignments that has been given by uh, Shobha Madam, try to finish those assignments. In case if you guys have any problems with language or with respect to doing practice, kindly get in uh, touch with Tabriz. Okay, and as I said. these trainings should not be like a spoon feeding training it's not like you come sit here and get everything if at all if you really want to get something more in that case you have to put some efforts in youtube in google understand something what next class shobha is going to take and then you have to be prepared so that you can ask better questions okay and practicing is equally important if anyone is not able to practice for any reasons you can just let tabriz know about it okay and uh, see uh, once uh, you have completed all the courses how different your uh, resume should uh, would look like so be more dedicated in case if you are not able to attend for some x y z reasons keep the admins informed because without informing if you are been absent for continuous 3 days in that case i will not be keeping it because there is certain limits in terms of groups also some others would get benefited okay so thank you tabrez thank you shobha for arranging all these things i'm happy to see this thank yeah you. now all together next uh, to shobha and tabrez all the best guys shobha you can just uh, start up some small introduction today okay and from yeah. tomorrow onwards you can start with the class okay you continue yeah, to chair sure. your, your introduction okay yeah hi hi good evening all so my name is shobha i am a freelancer okay so here in the this class no like you will be learning a ms office and tally both both together ms office and tally so in the ms office is a uh, three things we are going to do that is ms word ms excel and powerpoint okay so uh, here no i will be giving you most of the um, assignments to practice okay and uh, you you will be having some of our admin people to help you out in the assignments okay so they will guide you with all the assignments everything and most importantly is that like what abdul sir told like if you are not able to attend the class so i request you all please do inform before only if you are not able to attend the class okay second uh, point is that like practice practice is more and I think we lost you, Ms. Shobha. Still there? So my point of view is that, like, if you are not able to attend, please do inform that you are not able to attend the class. And this is most importantly, it is an interactive class. Interactive class means what? Everyone should interact in the class. Okay, so everyone should come. You have to ask your doubts. You have to show your presentation. You have to show your assignments. Everything. So if you people interact only, we can help you. And if you people interact only, we can come to know about your communication skill. okay so the previous batch now whatever we have done from that previous batch we have picked few students as a admin so if you all interact if you all discuss something all the assignments if you discuss definitely in the future you will be getting an opportunity to work with us definitely we will also guide you how to earn and how to learn remember okay so learning and earning is more important got it no so like those kind of all the guidelines we can provide to you in the sessions okay
Is it clear now? Is my voice audible to all? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma it is audible, right? Yes, ma'am. Okay. Fine. Yes, so let me show you a few of the assignments, few of the PowerPoint presentations. Okay. Mm, yeah. Let me show you one of the project also that uh, say like uh, by end of the session, by end of the session, you should be able to do what you will be able to do by end of the session. Let me show you that project also. So if I explain you now, say what happens like uh, you will not be able to understand say what are all the contents that we do we can send you the contents but uh, those contents you know like you won't be able to understand all those contents so that's why so most of them they are requesting for uh, recording this session is not required not needed to record uh, Okay, this is only the introduction session. So you don't have to record this session for today. So from tomorrow onwards, you can record the sessions. Okay. Okay, ma'am. Sure, yes, ma'am. Ma so it is appreciation that like uh, most of you are getting serious about your sessions and you are asking a permission for recording. But today is it's only an introduction. So it is not required to record your sessions for today. Tomorrow onwards, be more serious and uh, record all the sessions, practice more and more, become more perfect. Okay. <clears throat> okay, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Okay. Just uh, give me one minute. I will uh, just uh, share you my project or details to you. Okay. So by end of the course, you should be able to prepare uh, this kind of a document. You are able to see my document. Correct. So this is a project that I will be providing for you by end of the course. So you can see how neatly this project has been prepared. And most importantly, this is not a small project. Uh, this is one of the tasks. Uh, where in one of the MNC company they provide to their employees. Okay, this is a Microsoft project. You can see. So it's not like only the template. The first one is the image that you have to add. Second one is a paragraph with a different line spacing you have to use. Third one is a paragraph plus right side one small image that you have to adjust. Fourth one is a tables that you have to use not only tables but also the icon you have to set. See these are all it is a icons. Okay so like let me show you. See these things these are all it is a icon. See the icon you have a small yeah. icon and uh, it's like say you can see an icon and you can see with the blue color background there is a text this is a table and see there is no gap between one uh, box to another box with is uh, it is with a shading with a gray color light gray color shading is also given for this boxes okay these are all like a line spacing you have to adjust for your uh, paragraph in a box this is not a box actually this is called as a table you have to insert in the ms word document got it so these yeah. kind of uh, skills are more important for you to your uh, career for your job also let me explain you this is a document uh, it is given in one mnc company for employees those employees are freshers got it those employees are freshers they have joined the company after they joining to the company, after six months, they have given this task to do for those employees. So can anyone tell me what is the reason for that? After joining six months, they have given this document to those employees who are freshers to complete with this project. Any reason? Can anyone tell me what is the reason for that? <clears throat> So what will be the reason? See, anything if they want to give, they have to give in the time of interview. They have not given at the time of 
interview process. So interview is normal aptitude test or a group discussion or face to face interviews will be there. So after all joining to a company after six months, they have given this project. But what is the reason for that? They need to have expertise in uh, doing that project. <laughs> Experience. So basically, this is uh, regarding, uh, yeah, someone have messaged like uh, ability to check the ability 100%. Yes, this is to check the ability. Second yeah. thing is that, uh, uh, like uh, to check your presentation skill, to check yes, your presentation because this is a document done in the MS Word. Uh, the same document you can also do it in a ms uh, powerpoint also how you present yourself is more important this is already the one which is ready made which is already done so they have asked you to do same thing as it is you have to do it's like no changes you should make understand no so to check your ability to check your skills to check how fast you can put all the things all the um you know, like options, how fast you can use all these options. Main thing is like to check how how you can present yourself in during a time. They will give a time constraint for you. So in so time you have to submit. First thing, ability, how you present yourself, how much time you're taking for that, how much fast you're finishing your work. Understood, no? So these things, they will check you. But the reason is after six months, why they give you immediately also they are not giving after six months, after one year, they're giving you. Why? Because say in some cases in the interviews, even if you don't know any skill also by seeing your communication, by seeing your confidence, they will give you the job. Understand? They will wait for three months. They will wait for five months. They give an opportunity for you to work. But in the three months or five months, if you are not able to prove yourself, if you are not able to prove yourself, they need one reason to terminate you. Got it? They will give you one task where if you are not able to finish that task during a time, so they will get one reason. Same way, not only this kind of documents, similar kind of documents they will ask you to do. If you are not able to perform it well, they will get one reason to terminate you. That is the reason they will give you after three months or after six months to perform this kind of documentation work. Understood, no? So that's yes, why we suggest every student before you join any company, go with a complete knowledge. Complete computer skills should be there. Okay, computer skills means like say again, computer skills now it's like an ocean. You learn, you learn, you learn, you keep on learning. It's not like complete 100%. Minimum knowledge you should have. Basic knowledge. This is MS Office only. Basic things only. It's not like more complicated also. It's a basic things only. Okay, so that's why we are into a team. We thought of giving these things, everything as a free coaching to all the students where they will get more benefited in their career path. Understood, no? So say like uh, this, these courses and all, you know, like outside, it's, it will cost too much. But we are giving for you for free, of course. Please don't ignore it anywhere. Don't waste your time anywhere. Sit for 20 hours, 30 hours. Practice a lot. If you are not practicing here, if you are not learning here, you join to any company without knowledge, these things will happen. They will find a reason to terminate you. Okay. Clear, no? Okay. Yeah, ma'am. So that is the reason. Yes. This kind of documentation preparations and all, it is more important for you to learn. Okay. So this is a word document. Okay. The same thing, the same same word document we have done it in a powerpoint also say even in the powerpoint also we have done the same document the previous uh, batch of students now so well and good they prepared very nicely so they were more interested they have learned many things so most of them they have done this powerpoint presentation and they have sent also okay in the group say let me show you the slideshow how this 
things you can do it even in the powerpoint presentation also it is a document but same thing you can do it in a powerpoint also see like this okay same thing uh, most of the things are same thing that we have done in the powerpoint presentation understood no so these are all very basic things only guys okay so we request you all okay so be more serious in learning clear no so classes once done it's not repeated again and again okay so once the batch is started once we finish with the topic for today it is not repeated again and again for the absents who are all absent in the class for them it is not repeated you have to get a notes from your group people most of them if you join through laptop or system you can record the sessions okay so be more interactive in the class so that you will not miss any of the topic okay so if you have any questions you can ask me further if you have any questions i think in the chat i see few people asking the duration of this class some people uh, are duration is a minimum 20 to 30 hours for finishing ms office so near about 50 hours it will take for ms office and tally okay for ms office and tally Class duration will be forty minutes to one hour. I live one hour. Forty minutes to one hour. Okay. Same timing. It's timing will be. Timing changes. is same. Timing is same. Seven thirty every day. Seven thirty by seven thirty or by seven forty the classes will start. Mm -hmm. okay. okay. So forty minutes minimum. Forty minutes will be the duration for this. Total duration is fifty hours for for your uh, MS Office and Tally. Okay, thank we you. We are doing a course parallelly again, both MS Office and Tally. Mm -hmm. Parallelly, we are doing it. Okay. This is thirty minutes and Tally thirty minutes. You are no, 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 not like that. Thirty, thirty. If I do like that, nobody will understand. Yeah, that's what weekly said, two days. Weekly two days, we are going to do Tally. Okay. Okay. Another okay. two three days we are working with MS Office. Okay. Parallelly, okay, thanks. Both together okay. we are going to learn. Okay. Is it certified, ma? Uh, certification will be. We will be discussing about certification also. We will update you. Okay. Yeah, sure. We will update you about a certification. Okay. Okay. Uh, forty to fifty okay. sessions to complete. MS Office and Tally also both together. Yes, See, sir. I will tell you one thing. Okay, say most of them, uh, like uh, you will join through mobile. Say if you are not able to practice, going any institution, if you are not able to practice, I will give you one small tip. Most of you people are using your Android phones. Correct now, most of you are using an Android phone. You go to yes, a Play Store and open yes, uh, MS Word. Download MS Word, MS PowerPoint, and um, MS Excel. Excel. Maximum MS Word and MS Word. Maximum MS Word you can use and you can practice in your uh, mobile only. MS Word yeah. easily you can do it in your mobile. We have yeah. updated. Okay. So if you don't have a time to go to an institution and practice in the cyber center or in the institute, you can practice in your mobile also. But that is a second option only. I will give you first option using your desktop. If you practice, then you will become more perfect. Okay. okay. You practicing in a mobile is a second option. All. Alternative. That's it. If you don't have a time or you don't have a desktop, then only you can go there. Okay. Mom, mobile. How can we do? I will explain you in the next class how to download that Android, uh, like the app, MS Word app. Okay. Any more questions you have? Huh? 
Okay. Any more questions to discuss? Yeah, I, I'm just check, uh, typing the same answers now uh, so that it benefits uh, some of the uh, other people. I'm just putting it in the chat because some people may not know MS Word, Excel, all this wording. Yes. Some people have same repeated question. They're asking, can they join on 7th? Today they can't. So I didn't understand the question. If you can speak up. Are Say, you like, ma'am, I'm going to 7th. Can I join tomorrow? From tomorrow only, you know, the classes are going to start. What is this? I'm going to 7th. What does it mean? 7 p.m. or what is it? 7th. Can you, can you ask the question? Uh, if you don't mind, it will help you improve your... You have not also. given your name also, some other different because name it is showing you. Seventh class, definitely you can join. Definitely, definitely you can join. This is because seventh, eighth, ninth and all you will be having in your school also, right? Even in the school also, some basics they will explain to you. And it's a time for you to learn. It's a very good time before you go to your college only. Before you join to your 11th or 12th class only, you will be full-fledged with your computer skills. You can work independently without depending on anybody for your projects, which they give you in the school. Okay. So anything else? Today is introduction class. From tomorrow, you will start one. Yes, tomorrow onwards, the actual sessions will be will begin. Okay. okay, okay. If Fine. you don't have a laptop, download following app. Correct. MS Word, MS Excel, MS PowerPoint. You can uh, download actually. Okay. From your mobile, uh, you can download. You can just type MS Word only. Definitely, you will get that uh, option. The first option itself. Uh, if I can I speak, send uh, a Play Store or Google. From the Google Play Store directly, you can download. Uh, so okay. there are other alternatives. Uh, if I can, if I can pitch in, uh, Ms. Shoba. So if you don't have MS Office, because it's a hmm. paid licensed version. Hmm. Say MS Office, don't go for a 365 and all. Okay, and uh, you have other. Office so you have 365, you have many yeah. options are there. Many Let me there. just to share you the screenshot in the group. You can I will share you that um, that the thing I will share you in the group. Okay, just one minute. I am sharing you that group with the help of that uh, link. You can all uh, download. Okay. Okay. I have shared you that uh, Play Store group or uh, Play Store link. Just click on that link so that uh, there you can find MS Excel. Huh? Same way, like if you come below, you can find MS Word also. Let me also share you for MS Word both. Even for MS Word, Excel also you can practice. This Word also you can practice. Okay, you need some patience to practice in the mobile, that's it. And some limited options will be there, not as same like in the desktop, some limited options will be there. Maximum, whatever options you are getting in that, you can practice with that also, okay? I'm just giving them some tip, madam. Some people may not have uh, MS Office. So I'm just telling that yeah. you use open office, almost it's similar. Little bit small variance will be there. Yes, but, yes, uh, correct. You should not stop yourself. Try to use as much as possible. Do it on mobile, do on laptop, open office. There are other software also. But yes. understand the yeah, understand the fonts. The, the color, maximum the you have to work using the Android phones also. Why? Because you know when you are joining any company, always you won't carry your laptops, right? Any changes you want to do, the mailing or 
uh, any document you want to prepare immediately or any short message you want to prepare, you should be able to use your Android apps also. Every time we will not carry our laptops, right? 24 bar 7. Immediately, if at all we want to do this Android phone, uh, the, the one of MS Office, uh, which is given in the Android phones, na, that apps also, you should be able to use it. Okay. <clears throat> So any more, any more questions? No, ma'am. Uh, how about weekends? Weekend class will be there? Saturday, Saturday, Sunday, Saturday, no Saturday, classes. Saturday, Sunday, no classes. Saturday, Sunday, no classes. Monday to Friday. Thank you. Monday to Friday. Oh, thanks. thanks. Uh, it will be fixed days. Days yes, will the schools go on? Uh, forty to fifty days. Near about, near about fifty days. Almost two months, ma'am. Yes, almost two months. Because it is a two different courses. No, MS Office and Tally also so this is very important actually this this will be useful for everyone irrespective whether you go to a entry level job or you are a get into testing development software development or you go into accounts tally sap wherever you go you need ms office because yes. your everyday task you'll use uh, you have to write mails you have to write documents you have to use excel to uh, keep uh, track of things. Yes. Presentations will be. This is this is required for everyone. Mm -hmm. So don't see. Uh, yeah. yeah, yeah. So sorry, let no. me explain you. Yeah, sorry. Uh, let me explain you one more small uh, thing. Say when you apply for any jobs, uh, so um, HR people will uh, like say analyze your profiles. Okay. So while they analyze your profiles, uh, they will check two skills actually. You have, there is like in the HR policy, uh, before they screen your um, profile, you have a two skills there. One is a preferable skill, the another one is a mandatory skill. Two things are there, okay. In the mandatory skill, MS Office, Tally, Advanced Excel, um, from accounting side, I'm talking about basic, from basic level only I'm talking. MS Office, it's a mandatory skill. Advanced Excel also, it is a mandatory skill. Coming for a testing side, uh, testing side or any other, uh, like say if you are from engineering background, MSc background, BSc background students, uh, for you all, C, C++, Java, it is a mandatory skill for you. Mandatory. Mandatory means what? compulsory it is required preferable skills uh, in the preferable skills uh, you can go for a tally or you can go for a sap or you can learn any other accounting package also same way uh, coming for a testing also you have uh, like manual testing automation testing you have sql you have python you have r programming those are all like you know it's a preferable skills okay uh, like if you are from engineering background drawings, say AutoCAD, CAD related courses, there also AutoCAD, it's a mandatory, compulsory. Apart from AutoCAD, you, may, you have so many CAD courses that comes under preferable depending on your, um, which uh, education uh, you have learned. Okay, civil or mechanical depending on that. It's like a preferable skills. Hope you all understand. Preferable skills means it is optional. Okay. So if you have or you don't have a knowledge also, they will hire you for the job. Mandatory skills means compulsory. It is required. Under this mandatory skills, uh, MS Office, it is more important. Advanced Excel is more important. C, C++, Java is more important. So for MSc, BSc background students, Testing is more important, manual testing. 
so that's why we all in a group which is more important which is a mandatory skill for a students we have focused more into that and we are giving a training on, the, on that only understood no so you may ask why only this we are providing a free why only this we are uh, focusing more so many people in the group will have that question right so why these people are uh, providing uh, this kind of like say courses for free so like for them i'm telling you so mandatory skills for mandatory skills only we are focusing more and we are giving a training on mandatory skills for each and every student for their career path which which will be more benefit for their career path clear no yes ma'am yes, ma yeah. Okay, so yeah. So any questions you have, you can ask. Excuse me, ma'am. Hmm. Uh, it will be fixed days for MS Excel and Tally or what? Uh, fixed days, it's not like a fixed days. Huh? We will discuss because tomorrow is the first day we are going to start, right? So we will discuss in the class how the classes will be there and uh, we will have five days monday to friday in these five days depending on on the project work that i give you depending on the assignment work i will give you we can parallelly work for ms office also tally also i will inform you if it is a tally the day before only not immediately one day before so if tomorrow it's a tally class day before only i will tell you tomorrow it's a tally class for everyone in the group okay okay ma'am and one more one small request to everyone don't join on your device names please join in your original names that will be easy for us to maintain the record okay yeah if you okay, don't use your name it will be it will not be counted everyone it's a request to everyone if you are using through device your attendance is not counted for that particular day right uh, and you will be removed if you don't attend uh, continuously for few day, two three days mm. so better you use your names so, so uh, I use see your Sam full name yeah. use, right. use your full name um, once you join to a meeting use your full name please okay Okay, ma'am. Okay, then. So, any more questions you have, you can ask me. The class is about MS Office and Tally, ma'am. Yes, dear. From the beginning, we are telling same thing, no? MS Office and Tally only. Okay. Ma'am, HR, okay. we have to do that. Uh... PowerPoint, ma'am. We will Mark discuss Mark. all the concept wise. We will discuss for tomorrow. Okay. Okay, ma'am. Today, anything no work, anything, want? no, ma'am. No, 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 no nothing. Ma'am, you will be giving. Okay, ma'am. Fine. Anything year after, we will discuss in the group. Okay. Any 